All right, guys, welcome back to the Road to Super Sonic Legends series. We're in episode number 45 today, and today we are going to be Con Solo. Thanks so much to Jack H for this recommendation. We've got to make this thing now. All right, so let's grab a good Han Solo photo. This one looks pretty good. Get our Sunless Con. All right, I see, I see the, the magic. This is going to work. This is going to work. All right, now we need to make Sunless Con probably turn the other way. So he's, uh, you know, matched up with the, the face here. Kind of tilt him a little bit. Let's grab some of his head. Shaved Con. Here we go. All right. <laughs> think that's where I want him? I don't know. I'm trying to just place him near the head. Okay. Now let's get rid of the hair. Oh my god. <laughs> not bad. Not bad. We need to get the color up a little bit though because because we need to make him match a little more. So we're going to get the levels here. Bring this up. <laughs> oh my god. It's perfect. All right, there we go. Looks pretty good. I'm pretty happy with that. I think it's actually one of my favorites so far of the series. But look, we're going to jumping right back into the games. We're at Grand Champion 2 Division 4. In the last episode, I thought we would have made it to Grand Champion 3. Spoiler alert if you haven't seen the last episode. We did lose a game at the start of the episode. Uh, also, if you haven't seen, I actually have a playlist of all the episodes. So you can go through and check them all out and play them in order. But I just want to mention, as always, we are trying to reach 1 million subscribers by my birthday on March 31st. So if you want to help out and you haven't subscribed yet, it would help out a ton if you do subscribe. We're super, super close. It's a tight race. Currently, I need to make about 3,000 subs a day to make it to March 31st at 1 million. We're only like about 35,000 subs out. So getting pretty close, getting a little tight, but that's okay. Um, we're working towards uh, <laughs> working towards it. If we don't make it, it's all good, but it's looking like it could meet right on the day, which would be really, really super cool. Let's get into the next game. See how they go. Oh wow, we got Zanil, 1933 on my team, and we got Zerto and Brone. So pretty high level lobby. Oh, I gotta change the uh, the, the stiffness of the, uh, the dead zone again. Keep forgetting. I'm gonna miss. That's me a goal. Yeah, I just can't turn properly. Let's let's make sure we switch this up. My car immediately turned on the kickoff right there. I'm kind of like wobbling. It's kind of hard to uh, adjust. It was a good double though. Like I said, these two controllers that I just got that were new, they're really rough. I'm, I'm trying to get a new one ordered already. Oh, it's all good though. Get 50-50. Gonna pinch around. He's gonna pass it back. He's gonna stay close. Make him have to clear it and then back off. Go for that double again. Good save. Shot towards target. He's gonna miss. There's a the finish. So yeah, these I don't know what's wrong with these controllers, but like the dead zones are super, super bad. Like I have to go to 0 0.12 instead. And still my right stick sometimes shifts a little bit. Um, I can tell that like even when I'm sitting here. Uh, my tires sometimes turn a little bit like i don't know if you can see like they're wiggling and i'm not even moving the controller like the stick like even now so it's in it's been really rough to adjust and i think i should just get a new controller like right there just the, the four turns ends up missing pop over one zanil should be able to stay with this good 50. good pop and nice finish so i haven't really been able to do much uh this game so far. I got 74 points. <laughs> Gotta step it up a little bit. Yeah, this map does suck though. Make sure when you're on this map, you have low intensity on. It's the new setting. Up around the one player. Good first flick. Let Zanil go because he's in front. See if Zanil can uh, get behind me here. Good touch. He threw it away. Chip it towards net and there we go. It's a good play just to hold it around uh, the one player who dropped it in midfield right here. He flicked it away. So I just go for a chip around him and then go for the chip at the last second. That was I knew it was enough because the guy was like pushing up close post. And that's like that's the situation where you can get a, an early chip and just pop it over him at, when he doesn't expect it. Should be to Zanil. I'm going to clear this if I can. Oh, did he not? Zerto is AFK, so it's in the net. <laughs> I don't know what just happened. But we take it. Went for the uh, the pinch to clear it, and Zerto wasn't there to get the receive because he just sat still. <laughs> we'll take it. Oh, he's lagging, unfortunate. I think he might have DC'd. We're going to pop it up. Wait for the, the shot. Good save. Wait for Zerto again. We're in rule one, so hopefully my teammate can get back. Oh, good flick, though. Oh, it's off post. Oh, Zanil, I think Rizaniel realizes now that we're in a rule one. He almost left the net there, but uh, bro. Oh, he moved. You got this, buddy. Oh, no. <laughs> good try. <laughs> no, no, no problem. It's all good. 
I'm not playing well, that well this game just because I don't know. I just can't get used to these controllers, man. Both I've tried both of them so many times, and both of them just make me feel like garbage. So I've been like really struggling to play this game lately. But let's see if uh, see if we can do something. Try to get a bump on him. Didn't want to just throw the flip reset into the player because then I'm gonna be overcommitted. So I just like waited. There it goes. Daniel should be up for this. I'm on the right. He's gonna be up for that. I see the player trying to rush to the ball. In that situation, I can just go for it. This guy might miss, and I get a free goal. So I just wait for them to make mistakes. That guy is trying to push up and, and rush to a ball that's definitely lost. So in that situation, he has to realize that he can't get back to that ball. Not the, not the cleanest game in the world, but we do get the win anyway. Zanil is definitely a higher level player, but uh, either way, we get the win. And that's going to be eight points on the board. Super, super close. And we're 52 points away, at least from the mark that I thought. And there's the actual division up to division uh, champ, Grand Champ 3. So... Getting closer and closer. Really excited to get in the... This is the final rank before SSL here. So it's just time to climb up a little more. And and I was I was going to talk about this earlier in the in the episode, but playing at this rank has been really confusing for me in SSL. Like, I've actually... I actually went on a bit of a losing streak. It was probably partly because of the stupid controller, but uh, my, my rotations were really, really awkward. But I'm starting to fix it. And now we're up to 2200, I believe, on my main account. And I, I'm going to probably start doing a little more, uh, like, you know, high-level 2v2 gameplay so we can push into like rank one again even though first killer is like tw almost 2500 mmr so it's a bit of a climb yeah i don't know what it is but like playing rocket league with a controller that isn't like super solid is like really awkward because you you have you get used to your muscle memory and like sometimes the the motions oops should be okay though i'm gonna bait that guy in with that mistouch my teammates upfield i was a little bit uh scared of that wasn't sure if i should go for like an air dribble flick or oh I missed the boost again. Good, good, jo good job, me. <laughs> Get a little bit of a pinch, though. Let me clear from Jacob. I'm going to fake this because I'm last. Pop off the wall. Jacob will have it. I shouldn't have passed it back to him. Just pop up. Leave it for my teammate, Sneaky. Nice. I grab the boost from the opponent. Clear it around him if I can. Dude, I just don't know, man. I can't turn with this thing. Good play though. Left the ball. Go for this and bail my teammate out. I'm dead. To be my teammate to follow though. Good try. Could be a goal. Nice play. So off that off that touch, I was trying to make my teammate follow up off the clear. Ended up getting demo though. I was gonna go for a double, but then Sneaky was sitting in the net and yeah, the opponent was more ready for it. To be my teammate's ball here. Good. Ooh, okay, my bad, my bad. Should have read that. It's gonna be a goal again. Man, I'm just not playing well right now. That's okay though. We can bring it back. One guy's way out of the play. So it should be almost on target if sneaking can get around it. And there we go. So I know I'm going to beat him with the 50-50 if I just go. Um, and that way I just push up super fast with the, with the boost I had. And I can definitely beat him on the 50-50. And in any situation the 50-50 goes po positively, we're going to be you know at a good chance at goal here. Good save. It's a good shot. I couldn't get back to it. Try to go as fast as possible, but it's unfortunate. Good. Good 50-50. Make him panic. Don't touch it, teammate. No, I was going to clear it. What the heck was that? Oh, I was going to shoot it. Teammate should have a free touch here. I guess he gets pre-jumped, which could be really good for us. And there we go. Man, my turns, though. This this control is getting worse. It's just, like, super, super loose. Like, my, my car does, like, little micro stutters. Good. I actually could be, like, close to on target. Bad clear from the opponent, though. Give me a shot towards target, and there's the goal. I just gotta get used to the uh, over adjustments and it's like it feels like basically my car is like a rubber band which kind of sucks I, i'm sure you guys like some people would probably understand what i'm talking about like i've definitely went through a lot of controllers in my career but this one's one of the worst that i've had jacob's gonna be on this before me I'm gonna wait for snoop through the ball go early there we go it's a good try on the 50 50 sneaky has lots of space he needs to go early though because the guy's pressuring there we go See if this guy reads it off the corner. He does. So I'm just waiting. I'm just waiting for that double touch. I'm gonna go for the shot on target because they're not ready for it. I'm starting to move up a little bit, uh, a little bit faster. You know, stop playing so patiently. Not confident in my car's turning, so I'm like playing a little bit more hesitant. But I can definitely just use my confidence to help get past that. Wait for this touch. Get the double. There we go. So we're 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 just making it work. I'm not I'm not happy with how like the car is feeling, but. Sometimes it's how it is. Just gotta get past that and play your game. 
Good. Teammate should have this ball first. I, I don't know if he got that boost. It would have been good if he did get the boost because he was flipping towards a specific uh, spot on the field. I bumped the other guy off and it should be open net here. Wasn't too worried about getting that boost because I was worried worried more about him demoing me. And there's the uh, the finish. Sneaky played really well that game. You know, we got a few more goals with a, a bit of mechanics, but not much. And uh, we get another another solid win. I mean, I wouldn't say solid. I don't feel good about <laughs> my turns, like I said, but well played regardless. We're at 1770. All right, so here's here's the front of my car, and this is me not moving the stick at all. Like that's, that's like the little the little stutters that happens. Like I'm just holding my thumb, and it's doing this, and I'm having I'm having to battle that. So I don't know if I should bring the dead zone up even more. But the problem is when I bring up the dead zone more, my muscle memory is all broken, so it's already kind of bad. But like you see the the way that the the tires kind of like shift with my thumb. That's what I'm dealing with, and that's really messing up my turns because I'm not used to like that little motion. Like when I'm driving straight, like it's doing these little like these little like weird stutters. It's hard for me to like adjust to that. I don't know how to fix it other than just blasting the dead zone up because like when I bring the dead zone up, I'm sure it'll fix it. Yeah, that sucks. <laughs> I feel so heavy with this though. Like I can't, I, I don't feel like I, I can turn very well. So it's like a battle between like either being super, super accurate or <laughs> super, super slow. I'm going to stop talking about the controller, but it's also really annoying like when I'm doing the double flip, like the quick double tap on the A button, sometimes it doesn't register the second button. I've been doing a lot of those weird kickoffs where it's like a false start, um, and it's really awful. I get the boost from this guy. Ah, that's rough. I, just, I wasn't sure if my teammate was going to be ready for that. He kind of uh, stayed on the back post. I got the boost, but he didn't go for that. He went for the flip, and then he got caught in midfield. I don't think he was having it. He backflipped really, really late, so I had to try for that. Get 50-50. Should be uh, the opponent to collect the ball in the corner here. All right, it's fine. My teammate doesn't trust me at all, so that's okay. Should be a shot towards target at least. They can panic a little bit. Almost own gold. Off the corner maybe. It's a bit heavy. Should be the opponent's touch here. I'm wasting a lot of boost, but. Boop. There we go. Casper should be able to follow. Good 50-50. Should be my teammate to follow. Yeah, I wasn't sure if he was leaving that for me. It looked like he wanted to cut in and take the uh, the ball with the boost. Ooh, didn't hit that touch. I bumped the player out of the net though. If therapist beats here, it could be good. It's fine. Not really in a good position for that though. I thought he was gonna pass it to me when I was in that spot. Oh my. Should be a play for my teammate. Could maybe finish it. Nice play. Oh my goodness. <laughs> For some reason, it looked like someone left the game when that happened. I don't know why. I haven't seen that Buffy Sugo uh, explosion in a while. Get 50 50. Turn my teammate to the corner. Oh my. Okay, that was close. We're all good, though. We have got six saves. Oh, I don't, can't get that one, though. <laughs> oh boy. Yeah, we're just not able to get, like, good pressure. Right, let's see if a uh, therapist can get a solid play here. Nice. Definitely get the beat on the one player. Game is going to fake it, which is smart. I'm going to save my boost because I'm low. Ooh, good play. Be able to take this around. Both players are really close. Get to clear off the corner. And if I can follow this, I'm going to fake it so that he goes for it. Get a shot towards target. At least pressure a little bit. Nice. Good clear from the opponents. End up missing. My teammate's not there though. Could be a finish. Close. Definitely should have been a finish for my teammate, but that's all good though. Thought he was going to be ready for that once they missed. I think he was maybe waiting for the clear. Good play though. Cast going to go for the immediate challenge. Probably demo him. Should be a shot towards target. Gammy's ready for it though. Help him a little bit. Therapist should be there for the shot. He's not there though. I'm going to chase it instead. To my teammate to finish. There we go. My teammate's playing pretty far away. I thought he would be ready for the next touch. It was just spilling into mid. I just ball chase instead because like, I was like, he should definitely be there. He's just super slow. The time he got there, by the time he got there, he was already giving the opponent space to, uh, you know, get a clear or at least a block. Needs to go a little bit faster. And uh, that's what I did. Same here. I'm just going to go a little faster than normal. Bump a little bit to be a finish. And there we go. I just need to pick it up, man. I think, honestly, I'm just playing a little bit more reserved in this rank when you just need to ball chase and go. Because <laughs> that's kind of what it is. Like, I'm playing, like, as if I'm still, like, in, you know, champion rank, I think. 
at this point, like, to get into SSL, you need to play like an SSL, and that's not what I'm doing. I'm, I'm playing a little slow. So I just need to play less reserved and just go for the ball. Should be an uh, open shot, though. This is what I was talking about how it was messing me up in uh, my SSL games, that I was playing, like, this reserved way, where I'm just, like, you know, waiting for things, and, and at this rank, you just need to be, like, balls to the wall and just kind of go. And I definitely just need to do that more often, because, um, what's happening? <laughs> We're going to ignore the chat, you know, honestly, it's okay. I don't remember what I was saying. I just, okay, I do remember what I was saying. I basically, I'm just like not playing like the way that I would normally would, which is stupid because I'm at the point where we're almost at 1800, where at this point, you're just, everyone that's in there is just playing as fast as they can, but it just might not be the decision making or rotations that um, are super clean. Like everyone's really, really mechanically sound. Like people can do a lot of stuff, but they're just not able to, uh, you know, keep the consistency to get up to you know 2200 or, or even higher like in the top 100 so for this last game i'm just gonna play it as if you know i'm playing myself and i'm just gonna ignore everything else we got caster on my team so it should be pretty solid i know kromsky i've seen him before never seen this cloud guy though from Cynet. so let's see how this game goes let's play it out smart feeling better with the uh, the dead zone definitely better than 0 0.10 but i'm going to order a new controller right after the, this episode <laughs> i'm tired of it no way for the demo. He's gonna go for he's going for the bump attempt. Pop over one. He's gonna go for the, the bump here. Oh. Yeet! <laughs> and it's gonna be open. So just waiting for the pop. I'm just waiting for them to challenge, and we get the uh, double pop to just destroy both of them as they're challenging, so. <laughs> Looked really silly, but it works out really well. The, the other guy barreled in as well, so makes two for one. Two words one stone. If Cloud goes for the boost here, I got a free touch. Go for the backboard. See what Kromsky does. Let's get a shot. I'm just gonna start ball chasing, like I said. I'm gonna play a little bit faster. So maybe my teammate staying with this. Nice. A bit high off the corner. If he doesn't go, I can go for a shot. Go for the late bouncer. Should be a shot. There we go. So right there, the guy didn't go up the back corner when I made that clear. Like right here, I think Cloud should have immediately gone up the wall, but he didn't. And Kromsky wasn't able to turn. And then I just go for the the late shot to bounce it. Could be towards his net if he doesn't go back in time. Oh my god. Free touch for my teammate. Decent shot. Once again, I'm just going a little bit faster than I usually would in this series. Just making sure my rotations are quick. There we go. See, how, see what I'm saying? Just like go as soon as possible and you get, you get goals because of it. It's, it's really ridiculous. I, I'm not a big fan of the twos meta right now because of how like you can just like kind of chase it. And you know, without... Because everyone's recoveries are super, super quick nowadays. That if you just go for things and then uh, go for uh, a challenge and then just back out and recover super fast, you can kind of chase the player who's making a dribble uh, as first man. So I'll explain that a little more in the next episode. But I hope you guys enjoyed regardless. Definitely a bit of a weird one just because of my controls. I don't know. I, I'm trying to get used to it. I'm going to definitely order that controller right now. And I'll post a photo of it. I'm thinking I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to see if I can get one of those Space Station uh, controllers, the scuff controllers. But until next time, guys, have a great day. And we'll catch you guys in the next one.